caught on camera, a couple unknowingly pulls up to a late night street takeover. And as they try to drive away from the hostile crowd, someone opened fire on their car. Matt Doherty talked to that terrified couple who wants the shooter arrested. People getting out of their cars everywhere is pretty uh, surreal just to stop and not be able to do anything, just a complete street takeover. The man whose voice you hear is the driver of the car. His fiance is in the passenger seat, their dog is in the back. They asked us not to use their names or show their faces. I don't understand why. The couple says they were heading home from a friend's house early Monday morning. As they got closer to the intersection of Enclave Parkway and Forkland Drive in West Houston, cars were double parked along the sides of the street. Up ahead, a crowd stood in the roadway, watching cars perform donuts beneath the stoplight. There was no way for them to get through. The driver says a person with a megaphone realized he wasn't supposed to be there, and the crowd surrounded the car. And the crowd figured out it was a, a Tesla and it had cameras, and this you know, was going to capture everything that was going on around them. And on top of that, they realized that we had probably called the police, sure enough did, and they were going to take it out on us and we're going to let us through. What happens next, you can see in this video posted to Reddit yesterday. Oh, get off the, road! the couple is harassed and their dog taunted as the driver looks for a way out and his fiance is on the phone with 911. I was seriously wondering if we were going to get killed like that night. But finally, he makes a break for it and this happens. Someone in the crowd opens fire. That was frightening, just scary, just to see that under just no reason whatsoever for him to just shoot at us as we were trying to get out of the way, like literally just get out of there. The Houston police say detectives are aggressively pursuing this case and eager to catch the person who left these bullet holes in the couple's car. If you have any information, they're asking you to call Crime Stoppers. Matt Doherty, KHOU 11 News.